Johan. Okay, um, I'm Hilton Langenhoven. Um, I'm a three times gold medal winner at the Paralympic Games in Athens and in Beijing 2008. I'm a world record holder in the pentathlon and a former world record holder in the long jump for the men's visually impaired. Um, yeah, my life with Echo started in 2001 when my dream was to go and compete at the national championships in Kimberley. And for me, competing at that time was my enjoyment and to escape from a life um, of abandonment and not having a secure home and a proper middle home. And that was for me the start. Echo have, they have um, offered help to me to go and um, play my national championships and after that they have continued to help me paying for my um, national championships continuously until 2004. And in 2004 was my major breakthrough as a sports person. I've qualified to go and compete in the Athens Paralympics in Greece, in which I came back with a silver medal. And that silver medal was a changing moment in my life for me. It was something that I could have said, well, I've achieved something. Coming from a background which I was abandoned as an albino person, as a visually impaired person, as a disabled person in my community. And that was a token of achievement for me and to go forward. And the stature of that performance of winning a silver medal at the Paralympic Games was not well known in my family. They, they didn't know how to appreciate this, 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 this medal. What effort it took to win the Paralympic medal, whether it's gold, silver or bronze. And until this, she made it worthwhile for me to continue my sporting career. When I came back, she let the whole of Somerset West, the whole of the Aldebar come know about my achievements and what I've achieved. She made me feel like a new person again. I was like reborning, a rebirth of my sporting career. And well, they were there every step of the way, climbing the ladder up to the most successful point of my sporting career, winning the three gold medals. I think that was there in 2006 when I won the silver medal. In 2007 when I won the silver medal, the World Championships, the Commonwealth Games, and the African Championships in, in Algeria. And for me, that becoming second, second all the time with the major championships was a big questioning point for me, for the staff of ECHO, and for my coach as well. And what is that something special which we need to do to, to, to win a gold medal? And obviously, the support of your family and friends, to be educated, of respecting your, 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 um, your opponents, respecting people which you love with on a daily basis, and obviously respecting the fact that what got you this far, and you can, can continue in terms of that. And that for me was, it was, okay, I needed to, to train harder in terms of winning a gold medal, but obviously, to be able to know that the support of friends and family is there and that you respect your other opponents as well. Obviously, the, the, the results after that came and I've won the three gold medals 